You know, I don't know, except that he seemed to be preparing me from early childhood, and maybe it goes back to my mother and her, her vow to the Lord, give me, you know, through this son I will fulfill my vow to you. And uh, the early preparation and, and filling my mind and heart with the Word of God, and then um, in the teaching me lessons of faith through those lean years where we just received so little salary. Being obedient. Being, us, yes. Yeah. And, and teaching me uh, to trust in him. Teaching me then, and I look at the experience of Corona the first time I was there, and the failure. And, and that was an important lesson. So that when he finally got me to the place where he could then do what he was wanting to do. I wasn't going to take glory or try and take the credit for what he did. I'm sure that God wants to work. Uh, but I, I think that so many times people have been destroyed because when they, God begins to use them, they begin to uh, try and figure out why God used me. And, uh, uh, and I think it's a mystery. I look at it, and I wonder, why did God use me? He uses the simple things, he said, to confound the wise. And, and so uh, he, you know, I'm, I'm not a great, I, I'm, I love the Word of God. I love to study the Word of God, but I'm not what you would call a great scholar of the Word of God. Uh, but uh, yet uh, he uses me. And, uh, and, and probably uh, because... Um, I, I'm not really a, a you, would, you would classify as a theologian. Um, they usually are teaching in seminaries and not everybody can understand them. Uh, but because I'm just a down-to-earth person, I can share the truths of God in an understandable, simple way because that's the only way I can understand them myself. And so he uses that, you know, and... And those that are truly wise and all, they come and they, they can't understand the success and all uh, because uh, the, the things that they usually attribute success to are not here. And, and he's just using simple things to confound the wise.